So we are going to add a colony to this box and then transfer it over to my place out of an existing colony here at Alan's place. It's gonna be a block in the end. Now the dicey part is transporting this and not having that move. Got a little gateway in the entrance here. This this was a new box as of a month ago. I'm reading this one up for your place in mind. And it's a new Mishka Queen. Nice. I really hope we can see her. Pollen in the corner, a little bit of food store. What I like to do is cage her up that way in transport. We know she's not going to bounce around. Sorry. Really good brood, solid laying pattern. Bad breath works every time. Any questions, please feel free to ask. You, there, there, there are no dumb ones. Please don't hesitate. A little bit of food, intermittent brood, eggs, all ages. So she's laying healthily, they're happy. There she is, top right corner. Gorgeous caramel. That's a beautiful queen right there. Founder. Spectacular. That's that's tickling. No major issues. They're a little thin on food, though. So on your way home, Dave, you're going to get a lot of little spoons to feed them. I'll uh, stop by Wendy's and get them a frosty.
these frames. I hand built this one. Beautiful solid pattern now. There's not a lot of drone in here. Actually, I've only seen one. Yeah, they're just starting up. Not quite in the mood to have to move or go yet. There's a lot of weeds and blooms at my house. That'll be very happy. Fatten them up. Be excited to see a report on how much increase on the garden it's going to be too. Yes, definitely. Just the seminal pumpkin pollination is worth having a hive there. All I did was transfer the box to where the uh, original colony was. All the workers coming in from the field got to have somewhere yeah. to go. They're coming back into this one. Mm -hmm. If you look at the front door here, this is a great example of all the pollen packs coming in. And they're looking to get in somehow. Don't you want to run them in? Yeah. So now we're going to move this today? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's going home with you. What about all the ones that are out still when you move it? When I move it and I, dis when I disappear from that location, I'm not going to put anything in that spot. The workers are going to come back, we're going to fly around. No colony is going to turn down a worker with supplies. So whether it's they end up in this box or that box, they're going to end up in the other colonies and these are going to assimilate the workforce that's currently out in the field. Top it off and we're ready to move. Pull the entrance and reduce uh, back forward and yeah throw a uh, piece of tape on it and move along sounds good queen. safely right here where the workers are already trying to feed her all right Can they feed her while she's in there? Mm -hmm. Very cool. Oh, they can fit right through there? No. They can, she can't. Yeah. <laughs> That's why it's designed that way. Yeah. We'll put your lid on when you go to leave. So now I have something exciting back here. We are able to successfully move the bees. Right into my backyard. Soon we'll take out that entrance, let them run. They're already pollinating everything they can get their little antennae on.